There is also a marketing function. So if your dealership would like to do a marketing campaign, this is one way you could do so through Everlogic. So I don't know, let's say that I wanna do a winterize campaign and you will separate with a comma space. So if you'll notice here, separate with comma, okay? It gives you an example. I'm also gonna indicate hike. So I'm doing winterize on hikes, 20% uh, discount. And then I can search. So everybody that has the hike uh, with me and my dealership has come up and listed here. Now pay attention and notice some of them are on the mailing list and some of them are not on the mailing list. So let's talk about the difference between true and false. True means it was selected. So the items here with the check mark, that is a true. If these that are do not have the check mark, those are false. So let's choose the ones with true, showing now only those customers with the check mark. Those are the ones on my mailing list. Also, Let's say I'm doing an email campaign this time. And so if you'll notice in the email column, some of my customers have emails, but some of them don't. You would want to make your selection here and filter it down to non-blanks. Non-blanks will get rid of all the ones that do not have an email address. So I'm now ready to export. I can now save this for my customer marketing list. And I might even just put here that it's for a winterize. Title it however you would like. I'm gonna save that right quick. And now I can go over to my desktop. And pull up that spreadsheet. And again, remembering this is the one, uh, another item that prevents uh, Everlogic from being 100% cloud-based because we do allow you to save and export these items into Excel. And then of course you can navigate as you wish here in your Excel spreadsheet and save this for future use if needed or delete it after you're done. Okay, we're gonna go back over to Everlogic that was your marketing option here.